example, we're going to learn how to generate a scatter plot, how to create a trend line, and how to generate the regression equation along with the R square value. So first thing we want to do here is select our data set. So here we have two sets of data, calls made and books sold. So calls made will be our X variable and books sold will be our Y variable. So Y is the dependent variable and X is your independent variable. Now the idea here is using the regression equation, we are trying to predict Y. Y represents again books sold. So in order to generate our scatter plot, we first select our data set. Then I'm going to go to the insert section and select scatter plot. Once the scatter plot is generated, you can click on any dot, right click and select add trend line. The format trend line option will open up on the right hand side. All you want to do is scroll down and select display equation on chart and the other option below it which will be display r square value on chart. Once that's done you can close it. So here you have it on the trend line, you can see my R square value, which is 0.5343 and the regression equation, which is displayed right above it. Now the R square value usually ranges from zero to one and it's expressed in terms of a percentage. So if it is one, it means it's hundred percent. Now a high, a high R square value is usually anything above um, 0.85 all the way to 100%. This R square value depicts or tells us the goodness of fit measure of the, our regression model. The idea here is that it indicates the percentage of the variance in the dependent variable that the independent variable can explain. So in this case, there is a 53% chance of this variability being explained. So again here, we are trying to predict our Y variable, which is book sold by using our independent variable, which is calls made. And you can also do this check by looking at the axis. So you can see here on the X axis, our calls made data is displayed and our on our Y axis, you can see the book sold variable being displayed. So this is a quick and easy way to generate the trend line and to generate the R-square value and the regression equation.